uh, this is the book of First Peter, chapter 5, verse 7, and it reads through the Holy Scriptures, casting all your care upon him, for he care for you. Shalom, first and foremost, I like to give all praises and glory and honor to, to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Bukhar Kadash. Double honors to the elders for preaching this word truthfully and sincerely. And shalom to the Akim, scattered through the four corners of the globe, preaching the word truthfully and sincerely as well, too. And I say shalom to you, Akim, out there. And this is a uh, sit down lesson that I want to uh, bring out as of April the 3rd, 2023, at 9 12 a.m. on this uh, Monday morning. And the title of this lesson is Cast, Casting All Your Cares Upon Him. For he care for you. And I'm going to bring it out again for edification's sake of this uh, sit down lesson. This is uh, 1 Peter 5 and 7. Casting all your care upon him. For he care for you. Right? Because the Lord care for you. You know, children of Israel. Especially, particularly the Israelite man. So, all these uh, modal thoughts, all these evil thoughts, all these uh, mood swing, evil mood swings and stuff like that. You know, that's why we have our faith and love and trust in the Lord. You know, he give us, he given us wisdom, knowledge, and understanding in a sound mind, a stable mind, a positive mind, and moving to the right direction and the right in the right path and the righteous path of the Heavenly Father, Yahweh and his unbegotten son, Yahweh Shai. So, you know, it's best to cast all our cares upon him and let him deal with it, you know. So that's why we have our faith and love and trust in the Lord much all the time that we can, you know. So cast all our cares upon him and let him deal with it, you know, as we have our faith and love and trust in the Lord. Because Yahweh is our refuge, our protection, our shield, and our buckling, you know. So that's why we cast all our cares uh, upon him and let him deal with it because he cares for us, you know. And this is uh, Psalms 55 and 22. Cast thy burden upon the Lord, and he shall sustain thee. He shall never suffer the righteous to be removed. Right, so as long as we continue to follow the righteous path of the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, and His only begotten Son, Yahweh Shai, so we cast our burdens upon him, and he shall, shall never suffer the righteous to be moved. And this is uh, Psalms 37 and 5. Commit thy ways unto the Lord. Trust also in him, and he shall bring it to pass. Right, so as long as we continue to trust in the ways of the Lord and his only begotten son, Yahweh Shai, he shall bring it to pass, you know. So, you know, that's why it's important to cast all our cares and worries. Leave it up to the Lord and let him deal with it, you know. As long as we have our faith and love and trust. And the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, and His only begotten Son, Yahweh Shai. You know, that's the 100% right path to uh, approach, you know. So with that, this was just a uh, quick sit-down lesson that I want to bring out. Uh, the title of the lesson is, Casting All Your Care Upon Him, For He Care For You. Right, so the Lord care for you, you know. So cast all your cares and worries away and let the Lord deal with it. As long as you have your uh, faith, love, and trust in the Lord and His only begotten Son, Yahweh Shai as well too. Because the Lord is our, our shield, our protection, and our buckler. That's why we have our faith, love, and trust in the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, and His only begotten Son, Yahweh Shai. So cast all our cares upon Him, for He cares for you. As I brought out First Peter five and seven. So with that, hopefully this uh, sit down lesson was edifying. Uh, on its uh, Monday morning at nine sixteen a.m. Uh, April third, twenty twenty three. So with that, I would like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Ba'ashem Yahweh Shai Ba'ashem Akakadash. Double honors to the elders for preaching this word truthfully and sincerely. 
and shallow on to the Akim, scattered through the four corners of the globe, preaching the word truthfully and sincerely as well too. Until next time, I will say shallow on.